Good morning, plumbers. If you don't know, we do everyday plumbing. The good, the bad, and the ugly. And for today's plumbing adventure, I have a water heater that is leaking. We're not quite sure what it is. If you haven't subscribed, consider subscribing. Follow this journey as I train my two sons at plumbing trade. It's going to be a long journey, but well worth it because we all know plumbing ain't going nowhere. We'll see you there. folks we're on the scene of the crime here and we got a little bit of a mess as you'll see it's not a leaking water heater it's you look up and it's the pump here Got an old bronze pump with a change motor. So we're gonna, gonna swap this out. Okay, it's gotta be done. And no sense in working on this. It looks like the seals are bad. Let's get it done. In my shop, I had a brand new bronze Taco pump, a 007, that I'm going to actually give to my customer because they're such good people, and I do a lot of work for these folks, and I've been waiting to give this to someone, and I just found the customer. It's their lucky day, and it's my lucky day to get rid of it, and the first thing we're going to do is turn off the power to this pump. Stand by. Okay, luckily for me, the pump is marked. Breaker 17. Bang. First thing I'm going to do is shut the water off here. Bang. And bang. Luckily for me, it's isolated. I'm going to take off a little bit of water, loosen these bolts, undo the wire, and then before I do the wire, I'm going to test this for power. So a pump is generally 120. I'm going to put on 120 on my voltmeter, zero it out, and it is confirmed that we are off. Some heavy duty wire in here, boys and girls.
sure that these are the right size flanges. If not, I'll be changing the flanges too. <coughs> uh, I think we're going to be good. So I'm excited for 2020. I know I haven't filmed a lot. And what I really want to say is come May 15th, CB2 graduates from college and it's coming on board full, full time. I'm really excited about that. He's excited. And let's get this thing done. Let's get this boy learning. So we're pretty excited about the future of 2020, which I love that number. Uh, fantastic. Now, how much wood are we going to get here? I already drained it down a little bit. Get a little bit more. Got some water lines here that are just hanging from above. That's another problem, but that's another day. And you plumbers know we're going full face gaskets. Easy there, fella. Even though I think the full face gasket will handle this, I'm going to try to get most of it off here. Bang. It's a wrap. Boom, 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 boom. This one's actually good. towards the water heater. Electric's just going to make it. Oh, the 
arrow has gone back the way it was towards the water heater. I'm going to go to my truck. That's okay. I'm sure I should carry both in the bag, which is ideal. apprentices out there, you want to tighten them up evenly, okay? Let the, can, let the gasket do the work. I'm going to go down and get my other wrench. Alright, I got my wrench. Let's tighten this all up. Boom, 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 boom. Nice and tight. One, two, three. Dun, 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 dun. How about this winter? Has this winter been totally a joke on the East Coast? and the purge is actually on the other side of the wall which is kind of crazy but we do have a purge we let a little bit of water out of this system here and we're going to have to purge the line just to make sure there's no air because we don't want to burn out this new pump new use pump so what do you guys do for good customers a little bonus time, a little free work, reduced rate work, throw in a new pump. Who's giving back today on this lovely Saturday? I love it. I love it. I love it. And 
And I haven't done a lot of films to start 2020 because I've been involved in some other things, but I am in for the long haul. I can guarantee you that, God willing, because the apprentice program, the, the, the apprentices that reach out to me and young people is fantastic. I love it. So all you apprentices out there, keep writing me and I'll keep responding and I appreciate it and uh, plumbing ain't going nowhere, you know that. Right, let's get this wire and that's tied up. Here we go. White to white. I think this is 10 wire. These guys weren't playing when they wired this joker. Who loves plumbing today? I'll be honest with you, I haven't really been working in the truck at all. A couple other issues, but hey, you know, this is fun. I love it. I'm going to teach. Where's them young bucks at today? AB is closing out his basketball season. Freshman, Stockton University. Chucky's closed out his senior year at school. And it's about to get real. That's all I can tell you. That's why I know I'm in for the long haul on teaching. Because that is the game I plan on playing with these young fellas. They love the camera, don't you? CB, where you at? Talk to me. Where you at today? Huh? Okay. Let's go purge. A recirc line on a domestic hot water is just like a heat loop line. And you got to have a purge. So we're going to purge both sides with it open. I'm actually going to open this with this open. And, and then, of course, get the air out. Which it ain't going to be much, but it'll be a little bit. Okay. turn the water off so we're gonna turn it back on she just fired right up and we're gonna go turn the breaker on and see what happens here oh there's my ankle Jesus Christ oh There I go, I tripped again. There she goes. 
she's humming real nice. There you have it. We got that pump installed. A little gift from the plumbing shop. And uh, we truly appreciate their business. And when I can do something like that, at cost or for even free, I'm loving life. All right? So with that, we'll see you at the next one. And there goes another satisfied customer. Have a great weekend, folks.